Hi everyone, let me show you how you can generate a report like this to analyze the impact of AI overview on your list of keywords. This tool lets you analyze an unlimited number of your target keywords and it will show you if the percentage of keywords that generate AI overview and also their links and the cited domains for each keyword. To start working with this extension, you need to enter any keyword that comes to your mind. Uh, for example, here I will write AI overview because we need this page in order to start out working with the extension. From here, select the extension, activate it with this button, and as you can see, a sidebar will appear. And from here, what you need to do is to enter your list of comma separated keywords in this uh, field. So for example, here I have this list of keywords. I will use this tool in order to make them comma separated. You can use any tool that you like. And after that, I'm pasting them and then I will click on the search button. Now you can see the operation has started. It's going through each of the keywords one by one and you can track the process of the work here. I have 20 keywords for this demonstration and yeah, 20% is complete. So let's wait for it to be done and then we'll be back. Okay, now the processing of all the keywords is done. And as you can see, this text here appears and tells you the process is complete on also this download button appears. So both of these are a sign that the work is done. And a great point about this extension is that you don't need to remain on this tab. You can go to other tabs, do your works until it's done. So this is a really great point about it. And now that the processing is complete, let's take a look at each of the tabs. We'll start with the report tab. Here, there's a list of all keywords uh, and it will show you which of them generated AI overview and which of them did not generate this overview. We have a short summary report here that shows us, you know, for example, 11 of them generated AI overview. And we have this donut chart here that visualizes the information for us as well. This information will immediately give you an idea of what percentage of target keywords are impacted by AI overview. One important point here is that if for any reason you think the report is, you know, not complete or you want to do investigate further for a specific keyword, you can uh, go to the search tab and click the keyword that you want the search to be done again. And this time, if you click on it, a slower search will be done. It will take more time for the tool, maybe a few seconds in order to do the research and all the tabs will be updated based on the new search of that specific keyword. The next tab shows the length of keywords that have generated AI overview, a table here, a summary report, and a pie chart. All of these together will show you which lengths of keywords are more prone to generating AI overview in your niche. The next tab is about citations. Here you can see which domains are cited by Google in the AI overview section for each keyword. For example, here for the keyword, how to do keyword analysis, we have nine citations. And here we have all of the domains that appear here. If you click on any of these links, the exact URL that is uh, referenced, it will be, will be opened here in a new tab. So, and below this, we have another table that shows you the top cited uh, domains. This helps you understand the competitive landscape of the SERP for your target keywords. And the last tab is where you can check the keywords that have AI overview for a specific domain. For example, here I will search for semrush.com. I will check the domain and as you can see, a report is generated showing the keywords that have AI overview and cite semrush.com uh, in the citation section. At the bottom of the site menu, there's a help button. When you click on it, Informative tooltips will appear, explaining the role of each tab and showing you how you can contact me. When you're done, click on it again and return to the normal mode where you could see all the reports here. Before we end the video, let me show you how easily you can download all these tables into a spreadsheet. Just click here and the file will be downloaded. Then just open the file. And as you can see, a spreadsheet with four tabs will appear. All of the information is here in your hands. Finally, if you want to start a new search, just click here on the clear button and paste your list of keywords here. Click on the search button and go through the process that we discussed earlier. I hope you will find this tool helpful. And if you have any questions, you can email me at this address that appears here.
you can message me on LinkedIn or leave a comment under this YouTube video.